seek refuge in Allah from the cursed one. In the name of Allah, the abundantly merciful, the intensely merciful. O Allah, the Lord of the worlds, O Allah, send your prayers upon Muhammad and the family of Muhammad, the Imams and the Mahdi's. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said in his holy book, and peace be upon the messengers. And all praises belong to Allah, the world. All praises due to Allah who has resurrected us after we had died and has gathered us in this day and age which there is no age similar to it. And no age shall be repeated the likes of it after it. It is, it is a time in which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala prophets and righteous ones to support and give victory to Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi. The master of the messengers and al Hussein alayhi salam, the masters of martyrs and Fatima, the oppressed and al Hassan al Mushtaba, the chosen and Ali al-Murtada, peace be upon them and from them. All praise is due to Allah who, lo who left no excuse for anyone to say on the day of resurrection, if I was alive at the time of Jesus Christ, I would have been from his supporters. Or, if I was at the time of Moses alive, I would have been from his best followers. Or, if I was in the time of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi, I would have been from his companions. This is the chance, and this is the great test in this time and age. And today you see your faith and your deeds. And today, by your own selves, you see the size of your faith, and that the human being is a witness upon his own self. And Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made each of you, for each of you, two angels that write your deeds and are witnesses upon you. And do you know what are these two angels? Listen to the words of the family of Muhammad salam and comprehend. They are two ears, two eyes, two lips, two hands, two feet, and two testicles. That which the people think are two angels are your senses. The right senses record the good that you have done and your good deeds. And the left senses record the human sins and their bad deeds. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has made the human being a witness upon his own self and a watcher upon it. And he made the human body watch itself. Indeed, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is forbearing and conceals. And let each of you judge his or own self, his or her own self before judging others and before you are judged. And capture this chance in which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has placed you that you may support and give victory to Muhammad and the family of Muhammad alayhum salam. It is indeed a great race among all of the prophets and the messengers and the righteous ones and the believers. Capture the chances, for they pass like clouds. And fight yourselves, O believers. And do you know what is the self, the nafs? Listen to the words of the family of Muhammad and wake up. The nafs the self is from the making of our own deed and we make it either good or wicked our deeds what disciplines the nef and it resides in the chest area the nefs resides in the chest area it is something that you feel but do not see it is something you feel its presence in your chest the nefs is the forming of the senses and it is composed of hearing, seeing, touching and the tongue. From those senses the nafs starts to form then it divides into two parts 
The first part is the good self, and the second part is the wicked self. If the person speaks haram words, he will feed the wicked self. And if you listen to something haram, or look at something haram, you feed the wicked self. And this haram becomes the food for this wicked self. The opposite is true in regards to the good self. Until you reach a stage where you either grow the good self by your deeds, or the wicked self also by your deeds. So one of them wins and controls the other, and the result is known in both cases. And the good deeds are the more powerful. If you do a good deed, its effect on the good self is stronger. And if you do a bad deed, it won't have the same strong effect on the wicked self. Meaning, if the good self receives two points for a good deed, the wicked self gets only one point for every two bad deeds. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Fear your Lord who created you from one nafs and created from it its mate and dispersed from both of them many men and women. The self and its mate here are the good self and the wicked self. And not all the creatures have a nafs or a self. There are some human beings who do not have a nafs. Rather, they have souls only. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala said, Many men and women. But he did not just. He did not generalize it to include everyone. He just said many. Meaning, he did not generalize it to include all the human beings. Rather, he mentioned that a big group has a nafs. The soul also is affected by our deeds. And even though it is a few of us who have a soul only, not a nafs, this does not mean that they are the best. The few that do not have a nafs are the angels who became human beings in this time and age. And this matter is present with us today. We have Gabriel, Michael, and Raphael, peace be upon them. And they have the ability to appear in human form. And they are among us and in all the ages. All praise is due to Allah who has gathered us with the angels of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala in this age in which we have the opportunity to give victory to al Hussein, son of Ali alayhi salam with Gabriel, Michael and Raphael. Capture this chance and do not doubt, O believers. And do you know what happens at the time of doubt? Listen to the warning of the family of Muhammad السلام, and benefit from it. When a person doubts in his religion, he opens a path for the devil. And the devil, may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, plays with him left and right. And whoever doubts in the blessed black banners of the East needs to review his belief in the Messenger of Allah Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi and the purified Ahlul Bayt alayhi salam because for sure he has a doubt in them and their words and therefore he doubts in Allah the Almighty Be confident in yourselves O believers My father sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi said to me one day I want you to be confident in yourself you are a lion from the lions of the family of Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi and I swear by Allah the High, the Great, that even if the entire world stands against us, nothing will shake us, because we know and work by the words, there is no strength nor power except for Allah. All praise is due to Allah, who has resurrected me today after I died. Like He resurrected me when I was in the cave with my brother Moses, alayhi salam. And today I look with amazement, just as I was amazed when I came out of the cave. I look with amazement while I walk with Imran salam, and Mary salam, And we pass by churches and find statues of Imran and Mary and the people praying at those statues while they are ignoring the alive Imran and Mary. I look with amazement at the statues of the crucified look-alike 
And here I am, the crucified look-alike, walking among them. And I remember the incident of the crucifixion. And I see it in front of my eyes as I see the sun and the moon. All praise is due to Allah who has resurrected me today after I died. Just as the Rahman, the Rahim, resurrected me after I died when I was al Khidr, Jeremiah. And today I look with amazement, just as I was amazed when Allah resurrected me in Bethlehem. I look with amazement while I walk beside my brother Adam, السلام, the father of all humans, while I ask him how he feels while he has this number of sons and daughters, eight billion on the planet and he looks to his right and his left and laughs from my question and no one is aware that their father Adam is among them all praise is due to Allah who has resurrected me to look with amazement while I see Solomon peace be upon him as loving to animals today just as he was in the past and he is so careful not to even walk on the ants and all praise on all, and all this is due to Allah who has resurrected me so that I see and look with amazement at the people being baptized while they are not aware that John the Baptist is standing next to them. All praise is due to Allah who resurrected me after I died in my last round I had before today's and it is the round of Abdullah the infant. And he made me look with amazement in my chest, so I find in it a heart that does not sleep nor rest, if it does not hear the voice of Abu Abdullah al Hussein salam. A heart of a young child crying over his father al Hussein salam. The martyr, the oppressed, the exalted, the homeless, who had shouted in this day and age at the people asking them to support him and give victory to him and none supported him except very very few whatever you have done O believers to support and give victory to Al Hussein salam, do not let what you have done previously be a reason to stop you now the believer the son of Adam should be in a constant state of elevation and does not stop at any limit Rather, he must ask for more in every condition and every time. And always and forever repeat the following words. There is no strength nor power except by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Let your constitution be this in every aspect of your life. And you will become the happiest of human beings. But do not say it with the tongue only. Rather say it in your heart and mind and be a believer in it by words and actions for what is to come is very difficult and my heart goes out for you I swear by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala the high the great none remain upon this matter except for a few and patience is the key f and relief is the key to every door many will f fail and none will remain upon this except very, very, very few. Gradualists to whoever will be patient, even as the Imam Ahmed al-Hakuk, and even to the scientists of the West succeed in knowledge that I am on the ground. Many people will become happy, but only for for a short period of time, save the people away from him. And will be patient, alayhi salam, except for very, very few. And even the one who wants to compliment and say, I am patient, while his heart has in, not remained with him. Whoever reaches this stage will be from the winners and will not ever fail after that. All of you are capable of reaching, but whoever does not reach, is someone who does who does not want to reach the father sallallahu alaihi wa alayhi said to me one day i ask allah subhanahu wa ta'ala for patience for you and your brothers and sisters in what you will see and hear 
There is no comfort in the world, my son, and hurtful speech is worse than the sword, and worse than prison, and the false, despicable, impure accusations are worse than death. Be patient, for indeed Allah is with the patient ones. So be patient, for Allah is indeed with the striving, patient ones. I want to see Abdullah Hashim patient until I return to him. Do not forget this, my son. Patience. They will say a lot about you, but you will be written from the winners, inshallah. Who is going to be patient with me, O believers? Who will walk with me? Who will say words that will shake the earth and the heavens? Twelve thousand saying, Ahmad, Ahmad. Who will give victory to Al Hussein alayhi salam? And prefer Al Hussein alayhi salam over his own self and prefer the family of Al Hussein over his own family. O oh Allah, I ask for you from you patience, sir. Ya Allah, Ya Rahman, Ya Rahim. O oh Allah, please send your peace and blessings upon Al Hussein ibn Ali and upon Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa alayhi, and upon my brother, my beloved brother Adam alayhi salam, the father of all humanity, the dear one of Ahmed al Hassan alayhi, and send blessings upon. Moses alayhi salam, my brother and the dear one of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and Ahmed al Hassan alayhi salam. Please send your peace and blessings upon Jesus Christ. Peace be upon him. And upon Noah and upon him and upon all of the men. Send your peace upon my brother Aaron, Ahmed Murad alayhi salam. And upon all of the returned messengers and prophets. And I ask all of the believers to please do in this time everything to wake that you're in. And realize what day and what age you are living in. And to do everything you can to give victory to Muhammad and the family of Muhammad. By Allah, by Allah, it is a great, great race. It is a great, great race between the believers. And all praises due to Allah, Lord of the worlds. Alhamdulillahi Rabbil Alameen. Wa sallallahu ala Muhammadin wa ala Muhammad. Al-Aimma wa al-Mahdiyina wa sallam tasliman kathira. Wa sallamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.